wasted time to, with thy love. Abide in him always and feed on his word. Make friends of God's children. Help those who are weak, forgetting in nothing his blessing to see. Take time to be holy. The world rushes on. Spend much time in secret with Jesus alone. By looking to Jesus, like him thou shalt be. Thy friends in thy conduct, his likeness shall see. Take time to be holy. Let him be thy guide. And run not before him. Whatever be time, in joy or in sorrow, still follow thy Lord. And looking to Jesus, still trust in his word. Take time to be holy, be calm in thy soul. Each thought and each temper beneath his control. Thus, led by his spirit, the fountains of love, thou shalt. Soon be fitter for service aboard. Good morning, Jesus. Good morning, Jesus. Good morning, Jesus. I am aware you are here this morning. Good morning, Jesus. Father, good morning. Good morning, Father. 
Good morning, Son Jesus. Good morning, Holy Spirit Divine. We worship you, Lord. Honor you. Glorify the Lord. Magnify the beauty of thy majesty. You are faithful. I worship you. Thank you, Lord. Jesus' name we pray. We'll take my usual song. Whenever we are singing that song, I see nothing but Jesus. And I know that no power can reign except Him alone. Sickness can never reign. Demons can never reign. Only Jesus will reign. And He will continue to reign. Yesterday you reign. You reign in my eyes.
move. Lord, it is your time. Holy Spirit, it is your time. Holy Spirit, it's your time. It's your time. It's your time. It's your time. Yes, it is your time. Holy Ghost, it's your time. It's your time. It's your time. It is your time. It is your time. It is your time. Thank you, Spirit of God. Those who are ushers to join, I will need two or three hundred ushers during the prayers. They should station themselves everywhere because the Lord will manifest greatly this morning. I was telling the Lord, Cripus has been working in massacre, first one, second one, third one. Now that is massacre and other miracles. We are in our own campground. Greater things that happen in massacres has been happening in this campground and it will happen now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, you are the Lord. We declare your lordship over our spirit, soul, and bodies. We declare your lordship over this gathering. We ask that the spirit of God will introduce the power of God. Our Father, yet no soul remain the same. Save the unsaved. Restore backsliders. Edify and spirit feel the saints. Let the lame walk. The blind receive their sight. The deaf in here. The dumb speak. Barren wounds conceive. All manner of sicknesses. All manner of diseases. Shall melt before the presence of the Lord this morning. Noticeable signs and wonders. Laudable deliverance. Shall be experienced this morning. Because Lord, you have paid the price. You have paid the price. You have said to it over 2,000 years ago. And you are worshipped by your stress when we are healed. Reach out to every soul and be glorified tonight. Lord, today is the last day of this program. May we never remain the same.
Lord, how will our states and nations know that we have been with you? How will they know except they see your touch in our lives? Ah, Lord, how will they know that we have come in your presence? How will they know that we have been here since last week? Some were here since last week. Some came in on Saturday. Some came on Sunday. Some came on Monday. Some came on Tuesday. Lord, how will they know we have come to your presence? If we return back the way we came, how will they know? Ah, Jesus. Jesus, 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 Jesus. How will they know? How will they know? Except they see, except they see. How will they know if we return back the way we came? How will they know? How can we convince them, Lord? How can we convince them? How can we convince them? How can we convince them that we have come to Holiness River Movement International Campground? How will they know? Lord, some of us came here with sin. How will they know if we return back with sin? Some came here with sicknesses. Some came here with challenges. Some came here with problems in their bodies. Some came here with heavy garden. Lord, if we go back the way we came, how will they know we have come to your presence? How will they know we have been at our new campground? How will they know? Except you manifest, 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 manifest. Jesus' name we pray. And amen. Be seated. Thank you, Lord. They will know we have come to God's presence. The world we know, we have come to God's presence. Your state, your nations we know, you came to holiness, come down. Be seated. Ah. The 20 minutes was taken out of my time with announcement and prayers. So you follow me, I'll, I'll be a bit fast because in the next, by 7.30, I will stop and enter into prayers. So, I'll be sharing with us this morning on a message titled Spirit Anointing for Evangelism and Ministry. Say it. Spirit Anointing for Evangelism and Ministry. Hmm. Are, you sure you, are you sure you want the anointing? Then say it convincingly. Spirit Anointing for evangelism and ministry. Amen. Amen. Isaiah chapter number 61. I'll be a bit fast. It says, The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me because he has anointed me to preach good tidings to the meek. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted to proclaim liberty to the captives and the opening of the prison to them that are bound to proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord and the day of vengeance of our God to comfort all that mourn to appoint unto them that mourn in Zion to give unto them beauty for ashes the oil of joy for mourning 
the garment of praise to the spirit of heaviness, that they might be called the trees of righteousness, the planting of the Lord, that he might be glorified. Amen. This portion of the scripture summarizes the topic. There, if from where we read, you can see the spirit there, you can see the anointing there, and you can see the ministry there. He said, the spirit of the Lord God. Because we have three kinds of spirit. The spirit of God, the spirit of man, and the spirit of Satan. And that's what the Bible says, the spirit of the Lord God is upon me. It goes further to say, he what? He anointed me to preach evangelism. To preach evangelism. To preach good tidings to the meek. He has sent me to bind up the broken hearted ministry. To bind up the broken hearted. To proclaim liberty to the captives. Everyone under captivity, your liberty shall be experienced today. And the opening of the prison to them that are bound. I noticed something. What I noticed is this. That the place of the Holy Spirit is no longer the subject matter in the body of Christ today. Prosperity, deliverance, and other places and, um, and, oh, seed faith and anointing oil is the order of the day. The place of the Holy Ghost is neglected. I want to announce to you that the Holy Ghost is not in the bottle. The Holy Ghost is in the person. It's not in the bottle. It's in the person. The Holy Spirit, after salvation, after sanctification experience, is the next thing we need to keep us afresh. To keep us going and to enable us to make heaven at last. The Spirit of God upon us will make us one to be faithful, to be fruitful, and to be truthful. You are not complete. Even though you are saved and sanctified, if you are not baptized in the Holy Ghost, you cannot go far in life and in ministry without the Holy Spirit. You will break on the way if the spirit of God and the anointing of God is not upon your life. You will be limited to God's dealings, to God's revelations, and to God's power when you are not baptized in the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is not speaking in tongues I'm saying, Pastor, I want to speak in tongue. No, you don't need the tongue. You need the Holy Spirit. When he comes, and then there will be the initial evidence of speaking in tongues. Is the Holy Ghost we need. You can never manifest the full blessings of the gospel without the Holy Ghost anointing. You will show the world little or nothing about Christianity if you are not baptized with the Holy Ghost and with the anointing. 
the place of the Holy Ghost in the Christian life one can never be negotiated two the place of the Holy Ghost in the Christian body is not something that one can just put aside Is the Holy Ghost that manifests the power of God? Is the Holy Ghost that convicts and converts sinners? It is the Holy Ghost that makes the word of God come alive. Wherever you see genuine miracles, signs, and wonders, the Holy Ghost is at work. You see yourself praying and praying and praying and praying. One hour you are praying. Two hours you are praying. Three hours you are praying. You are not tired. It's a sign that the Holy Ghost is there. You see a lot of prayerlessness today is because of the absence of the Holy Spirit. Some can't pray even 10 minutes. They can't pray for one hour. Ah! A child of God. In this wicked generation, Romans 8 says, The endless expectation of the creature is the world of the creation, is the manifestations of the sons of God. Hear me. I want to make the world know that without the Holy Ghost, there will be no manifestations of the sons of God. Without the Holy Ghost, there will be no manifestation. As I said, you can't go far without the Holy Ghost in your life. You can't go far. You are not complete without the Spirit of God in your life. It's, it, it, let me give you an example. It's like a man that puts on trousers, you put on shirt, and you want to go out without shoe. Are you complete? It's like a woman. That want to pray, you put on your wrapper and your, and your shirt and your tie. Are you complete? Take for you. That, that is you are not complete. Yes, sir, you put on shirt, you put on trousers. I mean, I mean, you put on trousers, you put on your belt, and there is no shirt. Are you complete? You put on shirt, and there is no trousers. Are you complete? The same thing when you are not baptized in the Holy Spirit, you are not complete. You are not complete. And hear me. The baptism of the Holy Ghost is necessary in our time. Because we are not in the days of the Old Testament. None of the Old Testament say even a man called Moses, he was never baptized in the Holy Spirit. There is difference between baptism in the Holy Ghost and being filled with the Holy Ghost. None of the uh, none of the prophets, none of the kings, none of the men of old we ever read about with all their exploits, we are ever baptized in the Holy Ghost. None of them. The first person that was baptized with the Holy Ghost was Jesus Christ. After that is the apostles down to our time. That is why John chapter 7, verse 37 says, On the last day, oh, and today is the last day. <laughs> Bible says, On the last day, being the great day of the feast. Ah, thank God for our Father and the Lord. The last day. Bible says, Jesus cried and says, If any man thirst, let him what? Let him come. Come. The Bible says that what out of his belly shall flow what rivers of living water. The Bible then says, with this he means what the spirit, because that it has been poured upon none. Why? Jesus was not yet glorified. You can see. You can see why you must get it, because it's in your time. Moses don't have it. Baptism of the Holy Spirit. Moses never experienced it. You have the chance. To experience it. I must tell you this. We are in a better dispensation. That is why 2 Corinthians 3 says. If the dispensation. 
written and engraven on tablet of stone was glorious. The Bible say, how much glorious shall the dispensation of the Spirit be? And we are in the dispensation of the Spirit. With this, I divide the message into three uh, subtopics. Number one, importance for spirit anointing and publicly assembled or spirit anointed men. The importance of the Holy Spirit anointing and publicly examples or spirit anointed men. Is the Holy Ghost important? Yes, it's important. Look at the book of Isaiah chapter 32. Very, very important. Isaiah 32. I read from verse number 15. It says, Until the Spirit be poured upon us from on high, and the wilderness be a fruitful field, and the fruitful feed be accounted for a forest. You can see that? There is no fruitfulness until the Holy Ghost come. He says, until the Spirit be poured upon us from on high. Until it is poured. That is when the wilderness, the dryness, the dryness, that is when the dryness in our life can become a forest, can become fruitful until the spirit be poured. Until the spirit be poured. So, number one importance of having the Holy Ghost is that is one is fruitfulness. Number two importance of having the Holy Ghost anointing is power. Church say power. Micah chapter 3, verse 8. Micah in the Old Testament. Chapter 3, verse 8. Chapter 3, verse 8. It says, But, but truly, oh, I, he said, But what? Truly, sincerely, but truly, I am full of power. By what? By the Spirit of the Lord, and of judgment, and of mind, to declare unto Jacob his transgression, and to Israel his sin. You can see that? Power. Ha. Hear me. We need power of the Holy Ghost in our time. We need power. Of the Holy Ghost in our time. Because there are things telling us, where is your God? There are challenges telling us like that. Hey, I remember last three weeks or so, yesterday, last month, we are holding a crusade in our zone. That's in, a, in one of the states, states uh, uh, in our zone. That's in Kaduna. Then me and daddy and mommy, we are in, in, in Abuja, do one or two things. Then I have to rush back that very Friday. And lo and behold, they brought a man. The tummy was protruding. The man, I, think, I don't know where they brought that man from. Whether, was it from the hospital? I don't actually know. The man was there, lying down, with big tummy, small hands, small legs. I don't know how they call that sickness. Big tummy. Here, the bones here shoot out, shoot out. The eyes enter. Ah, what is this? When I was praying, as, as I entered in, 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 into the congregation after the, after the, the preaching, during the, the ministration, I saw the man there, reaching there. They took him out. He was at the extreme. He was lying. They put, I think they put mattress on him. He was lying down there. When they pray with him, stand up. The man, the carrying, the man could not stand up. I said, I yell him. He said, he said, sleeping. What prayer was going on? Prayed again for him. Lifted him up. And the power of God fell upon the man. And he that was crippled began to walk. Yeah. Cardinal Brethren are here to confirm it. Praise the name of the Lord. Power of the Holy Spirit. Power. 
power it's not just talk it's power of the holy spirit come on brethren are here they will testify what's in canot for a crusade and during prayers it was later i was told the woman is pregnant imagine the devil is bad and she was para was it paralyzed she was using these her crutches and I went to her and said, Madam, you are healed in Jesus' name. I collected the two scratches. Stand up! And in their presence, she stood up and began to walk. Power is what we need. Power is what we need. Now, see the testimony we are sharing here on, on, on Tuesday. They showed the accident. Trega came and camped. <laughs> that, 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 that was when I. That was when I knew that treasure is, 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 is a serious issue. Three of them. Shout, enter into the bush, I told the driver. No way. He was confused. If not the mercies of God, the presence of God, and the power of God. The devil meant harm. Because I saw when the, the trailer was coming to clamp the car. And the man, Jesus! When I shouted, the man turned the little. Then the back of the trailer, not another, is it the back? I mean the body, not the back. As it turned, then the body and the tire come and see how this trailer crammed the car. I was at the front. The person behind me did got blood everywhere. The other trailer on the ground. See human beings, carry human beings to the ground. Blood everywhere. I tried to open the door. The door was locked. The boot was locked. And the Lord brought me out from the window without a single scratch. We need power. We need it. We need it. That is why you must desire the Holy Ghost this morning. Desire it. Desire it. Desire it. Desire it. Power. Look at challenges in our lives. In our marriage. In our business. And hear me. Do you know I love God's power? Because the Bible is in the book of Psalm. He said, in the days of his power, the people shall be be willing they be willing they be willing when the magicians were playing with Moses they saw the power of God at action what was their conclusion this is the finger of God and there is something I love there I so, I so much love he said the finger how much more the hands if it is a finger how much more the hand of God 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 if the finger of God can do this hear me even Jesus he told the, the, the world if I cast out demon by what by what by the finger of God <laughs> finger 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 of God how much more the hand the complete hand how much more did the complete hand of God upon your yard? How much more? Pray for it. Yet the world know we are children of God. Yet the world know we are what? Children of God. Imagine, take for example, Jesus Christ came and didn't manifest any power. Manifested nothing. Imagine how our Christianity will be. Power. Desire it in your yard. The power of God. Desire it. Once it comes upon you. Look at the woman. I meet reaching Kaduna. The following day it was doing counseling. It's power. Pray for when the God rests upon you. I was doing counseling because often for the crusade there will be a crowd. No time to attend to them. Then I dedicated that last week to attend to everybody in Kaduna. Reaching Kaduna State. They, they we've, we've announced it. I said counseling will start from morning until I finish with the last person. But if I come like that, there will be a crowd. No time to attend to, to, to most of the crowd. Then I was sitting down by, nine, by is it, it 830 or 9. I was in Pastor David's church there. We, we, we do the counseling. From that morning, I think I enter the house of our brother in Kaduna there. Almost after 10 in the night. No sign of tired. And that was, that was the day after the accident. Still on fasting. No food. Till that very night. And then this woman that is here now, what is that about the issue? 
I saw her, people gather more during counseling. Coming there. I saw her going and coming, going, I mean, going inside church. Going, going. I, I wanted to even tell those who are before her, maybe can we allow us to attend to that woman? But something just asked me. I, I, just, kept, I just kept quiet. When it was her turn, she just came in. I just said, ah, Madam, I saw you going now. You, you, you restless. There is the child. And the child was SS. I said, Oh. And this family thought was in my mind. There was one that came to Christ, and I was just passed. After preaching, I was just going the same day. The Russian came. He said, see, see, see. I just lay hand prayer and then left. Then I had been thinking about the family. How, I want to know how far. How was it? Has God turned the SS to AA? Then they said, oh, I said, madam, I've been looking for this family. This is the child. How far? He said, pastor, SS, suffering, pain, sickness here and there. I went there. I said, God will do it. I lay hand on her. I said, Lord, you turn water into wine. Turn this child from SS to AA. It was in the car. That was on Thursday. I met her here. It was not on Tuesday. She came to me. And what was the result? AA. Is it not the power of God? Pray for the power of God in your life. Power. Say power. Yes, the importance of the Holy Ghost in your yard. Utterance, it will give you utterance. Acts of the Apostles, chapter number 2, verse 4. Acts 2, verse 4. Acts 2, verse 4. It says, And they were all, they were all filled with the Holy Ghost and began to speak with other tongues. As what? As what? As what? As the Spirit did what? Gave them utterance. That is why you need the Holy Ghost. It will give you utterance. Real utterance. Utterance in evangelism. It will give you utterance on how to preach, what to say, when to say, where to say, and whom to speak to. It's the Holy Ghost. It will give you utterance. Even Jesus says, when you have been persecuted and brought before governor, he said, don't think of what to say. The spirit of your father, the spirit of God, will tell you what to say at that time. You need the Holy Spirit. We need the Holy Spirit. It will give us utterance, godly utterance. Utterance that we edify, utterance that we comfort, utterance that we convict and convert sinners, utterance that we change life and situation. It will give you utterance. Four, it will give you boldness. Say boldness. boldness. The importance of the Holy Spirit. Boldness. Some are afraid to preach, even afraid to travel. To Afraid to preach. Afraid, hey, accident. Which accident? Boldness. Boldness. You can preach to anybody on the face of the earth when the opportunity is there. Boldness. When you are afraid, it's a sign that you don't have the Spirit of God. Because first Timothy, sorry, second Timothy chapter 1 verse 7 says God did not give us the spirit of what? Fear. But of what? Love. What again? And what again? That is it. The spirit of boldness. It will make you bold to carry Bible and go about preaching the gospel. It will make you bold. It will make you bold. Even bold to pray for, for the sick. Bold. <laughs> so they say, I, I will lay hand on. The demon will jump and enter me. Eh? The demon will jump and enter you. <laughs> boldness. Pray for boldness. Boldness. Amen. Amen. It will give us what? Boldness in preaching. To present, to preach Christ and him crucified. Here yeah, example of men that we are anointed with the Holy Spirit for evangelism and ministry. I will pick one. Jesus Christ. Out of the Apostles chapter 10. 
verse 38. Acts 10, verse 38. At 10 it says how God anointed Jesus Christ of Nazareth with the Holy Ghost and with power who went about doing good and healing all that we are oppressed of the devil for God was with him that is Jesus hear me look up though son of God we didn't hear much. Uh, I mean, Bible talk about him, about him, about him. After his belt, it was as if the Bible was silenced. Later on, when he went to the temple and was there disputing with the doctors of the law, it was as if it was quiet. But when he, he became 30 years, went and baptized. As he came out of the water, the heavens opened. The Spirit of God rested upon Jesus. And a voice said, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. When Jesus got baptized in the Holy Ghost, where? At the river. Heavens opened. Spirit of God came upon him. He got baptized in the Holy Ghost. I love the account of Luke. Matthew chapter 5, 4 says, When that's what it says, when that happened, that he was driven by the Spirit into the wilderness. Then the account of Luke 4, 18, 19 says, He came out, out of the world, wilderness in the power of the Holy Spirit. And his fame spread abroad. His fame spread abroad. That means, watch out. Jesus never did any miracle when they gave birth to him. I mean, that manifestation was not there. But immediately, Jesus got baptized in the, with the Holy Ghost. Things begin to happen. Anywhere he goes, things begin to happen. Salvation became a must. God, anywhere he enters, people are converting. Changing lives here and there, traveling here and there, miracle signs and wonders everywhere. Thou son of the dead, have mercy on me. Nobody, nobody, nobody ever told him that before the water baptism, before he got baptized in the Holy Spirit. But immediately that happened is Jesus. Say Jesus. Jesus. Say Jesus. Jesus. Say it again, Jesus. Jesus. That is it. When he got baptized with the Holy Ghost, the Bible says how God anointed Jesus Christ with two things. With the Holy Ghost and what? Power. He went about doing good. Preaching the goodness of the kingdom. Healing all that we are sick and oppressed of the devil for God was with him. I will jump to point uh, number two because of time. God's promises for Spirit anointing for evangelism and ministry. That is point two. Let us see God's promises. Hear me, church. I bring you good news. The Lord has promised to give us the Holy Spirit. He has promised to baptize us with the Holy Spirit. He has promised to do so. To baptize us with the Holy Spirit. Jewel chapter 2. It was prophesied long ago. Jewel chapter 2. It was prophesied long ago. I read verse number 28. And it shall come to pass. <laughs> it shall what? In whose life? When will it come to pass? Now. Nah. It shall come to pass. It shall come to pass. It will come to pass. After all, that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Your old men shall dream dreams, your young men shall see what? Vision. 29. Also upon the servant and upon the handmaid maid. In those days will I pour out my spirit. And verse 30. And I will show wonders in the heavens. And in the earth, blood and fire and pillars of smoke. That is it. 
God has promised us the Holy Spirit. Upon which flesh? He said, upon all flesh. He said, but upon sons and daughters, fathers and mothers. He said, even servants. God promised to pour out his spirit. Prophesied many years ago. God has promised you the spirit. Yes. See the book of Luke chapter number 24. God's promise. Luke chapter 24. He has promised he will never fail. Will he fail? He has promised us. Yes. Luke 24. See verse number 49. And behold, I send the promise of my father upon you. But tarry ye in the city of Jerusalem until ye be what? And do with power from on he said, I send you the promise of the Father. I send you the promise of the Father. I send you the promise of the Father. Luke, uh, uh, Acts chapter 1, God's promise. Acts chapter 1, see verse 18, see verse 8. Acts 1, verse 8. Verse 8 says, But ye shall receive power. After that, the Holy Ghost is come upon you. And ye shall be witnesses unto me, both in Jerusalem and in all Judea and in Samaria and unto the uttermost part of the earth. You see that? You can't evangelize well without the power of God in your life through the Holy Spirit. Through the Holy Spirit. We must go out to evangelize. Tell the world. That Jesus is Lord. Tell the world that Jesus is coming again. Tell the world that repent or else you will all perish. Power for evangelism. He promised it here. Yes, he adds to. Yes, here from Peter. Yes, here what Peter uh, told the. Acts 2. See verse number 39. For the promise is unto you and to your children and to all that are far off. Well, I start, let me start from verse 38. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of, you, of sins. And ye shall what? Receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. For the promise is unto you. Say unto me. And to your word, children, and to all that are afar of, even as many as the Lord our God shall call. He has promised us the Spirit. He has promised us the Holy Ghost. He has promised us what? The Holy Ghost. We need the Holy Spirit. He has promised us. And second, is it First Corinthians one, he said the promises of God are not are not yea and nay. They are what they are yea and in Christ, Amen. That is it. So long you promise it in Christ this morning in your life, it shall be what, Amen. He promised us the Spirit. He said upon all flesh, you need it even in business, in marriage, you need it. So that you can be an evangelist in your shop, evangelist in the office, evangelist of holiness movement anywhere you are, preaching the good tidings of the kingdom. You need it. We need it. Holy Ghost, once it comes, it will quicken your mortal bodies. You need it. I need it. We need it. You can't just be falling sick, falling sick, falling sick. When they called me, that we should, because of this, our, our traveling out, they called me, that, ah, go and, and get your medical decision. They needed to send it down to Beg John. I said, it's okay. I went to the hospital. They said, medical fitness. When I went there, they said, ah, they will just write and give you. I said, no. They should not write and give me. They should carry out every test upon me. I don't want to lie. Every test. And the doctor wrote and wrote and wrote and wrote more than how many papers or so? Four or five. They give me. They say, go so Being that I'm not a hospital customer, 
I said, where is the place now? They showed me the place. When I went there, I gave them at the lab. The woman carried there. One, two, three, four, five, six people. Hey, only you, all these pairs? I said, yes. Only you? I said, yes. He said, this one, you do it here. Your blood, your urine, your, 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 your wee-wee, your this, your dad, your, your this one. And they said, you enter a three. You remove your shirt. I said, no, no, no you shirt. They said, no, you shirt. Remove your shirt. This one. <laughs> when they did everywhere, then I said, remember one, go the other one. They did, uh, 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 is it high, high BP? They did it. They said, remember one. They said, they say, HIV and AIDS. They said, it's in social place. Me, HIV and AIDS. <laughs> they say yes. I say it's okay. I went there. They collected the blood. Then the man called me inside after a while. And you know, before we do this, we do ask whether you need the results or you don't want the results. And there are some questions they ask. I need the results. They say there are some questions we would like to ask you. And the man know me because he's in the town where I am. He knows me. He said, uh, I want, want to, he brought out a paper like that and was sticky, asking the question. He said, they do record it. I said, okay. Uh, how many girlfriends do you have? <laughs> I said, come. Don't you know me? <laughs> Pastor, it is hospital. Okay, sorry. How many wives do you have? <laughs> He knows me, know my wife, know my children. I said, you answer it now, pastor answer. I said, one wife, they take it. Uh, your children, I know you have four children. Uh, is there anyone from five years down? I said, yeah, my second son is, my, my second son is five years. And then my newborn baby is two weeks. Oh, he didn't check. Uh, I mean, some funny, funny question. I said, ah, come, this question of uh, this woman, uh, sex, this one, how many partners, where he has, you do them, this one. I said, come, don't you know me, Pastor? <laughs> Asking funny, funny questions. But it's, it's on the paper. And that's what they are busy answering everything. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, they carry out the assignment. At the end of the day, they carry out the something. And when they check, 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 check. They say, see the results. They gave it to me. And after, after giving it to me, I went to the doctor. They drop it. And they say, okay, see the result of your test. I say, it's okay. They begin to write, write. HIV, negative. The other one, negative. The other one, negative. The other one. Before they would talk, I would say, negative. So, this negative. So, I said negative, 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 negative. I was not answering myself. He said, this man, how bored are you? I said, I'm a child of God. I have the Holy Ghost in me. I can't be sick. The power of God is there. And the rest of them, praise the name of the Lord. When the Holy Ghost comes, it quickens your mortal body. It quickens your mortal body. Finally, before we pray, condition for spirit anointing for evangelism. One is obedient. We want to enter into prayer. I give you the obedience in this story. There is this rich man, very rich man, very rich man. He has everything that heart and life can wish. He has but one child, one child, one child. And his servant, the child was very stubborn. The child cannot listen to his father. The child is full of disobedience. The father did all he could to help the child. The child was never bettered, and the man was dying. He didn't call the child. I have tried to help you, but you can't help yourself. I can't waste my resources on you. Now, choose among my properties, just one. Then I will carry the rest and give to the servant. Choose among the hundreds of cars, only one you will choose, if it's car you want. Among the buildings, is it company, only one you will choose. Huh? All the rest will go to the servant. He said, I give you one week, go on and decide and come back. And within, you keep on worrying and begin to think. Everything, my, 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 my father's servant, 
all the riches, the companies all over the world. Only this, this boy, and me that is the bi bi biological child. And then on the third day, somebody came and preached to him Jesus. He gave his life to Christ, repented, became born again. And the sixth day, as he was sleeping, an angel appeared to him. He says, your father gave you an option. He said, yes, hmm, an option. The angel told him, choose your father's servant. And why servant? What do you have to do? What, what do you have to do with the servant? Look at money companies and the rest of them. It's not servant. It's, the angel told him, the servant is part of your father's property. If you pick the servant, whatever the servant has become yours. He said, all right. He said, Daddy, I choose the servant. He said, yes, my son is now wise and carry everything. And who is that servant today? The Lord Jesus Christ. If only you accept Jesus Christ. In every, God has given everything to Jesus. If only you accept him this morning, you will get the Holy Spirit. You will be an evangelist. You will be going about preaching, the, the God, establishing holiness movement everywhere. If you choose him. It's given to those that are born again. Have you repented? Have you been to Jesus with a cleansing power? Have you returned back the Wyatt result? Do you still have girlfriend? Are you still fornicating? Are you still, do you come here to, come here to look for a woman? Even so, today is the fifth day. Look at the big pump still on our head. And you want the Holy Ghost? What are your ranking tombs? Should they do me, do me, do me? And you are born again? Should they do you? Demon will do you in hell. Check it. You have to give the to Christ. Are you a man's second wife? You go to office by 10 and you write 7 o'clock in the morning. Go and change and repent. Correct that result. You are a man's second wife. You lie to the government. You get first statement in the police station. Condition for Holy Ghost baptism. You must be born again. You must drop your girlfriend. You must stop sinning. Boyfriend, adultery. Have you confessed the adultery? Have you confessed the abortion you committed? Look at the blood crying against you. The blood crying, abortion, masturbation, watching or blue film, even from your handset. Watching or blue film, changing your voice because you see a woman. Walking like a monkey because you see a lady. Check it. And you want the Holy Ghost? Check your life. Are you born again? Are you free? Are you saved? If they tell you, leave the, leave the tent, come to the hall of meeting. Do you come to the hall of meeting? Do you struggle for food? If they say, come and help and wash, do you join to wash the plate? Are you, or shall we say, sit here? Do you obey? Check your life. Check your thoughts. Check your ways. Have you made right your wrong? The government money you've stolen. People you are all here and there. Borrow post, borrow post, borrow post. Have you come back to clear the money? Check your life. Check your life. That certificate. During exam, number one A, number two B, number three C, and you did it and carry the result and go to university. Hear me? Return the result back to Wyatt. Go and make right your wrong. No matter how far you have gone, check it. Make right if you want. The Holy Ghost is holy. And it dwells upon holy vessels. You want the Holy Ghost? You must amend your ways. Rise on your feet. As we go to God in prayer. As we go to God in prayer. Begin to talk to God. Begin to talk to God. There is no time. I want to enter into prayers briefly now. Stand on your be on your feet. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the blood of Jesus to purge. Call upon the blood to cleanse. Call upon the blood to make who? Call upon the blood of Jesus. Check your check your handset. The boyfriend in your handset. Delete his phone number. Delete his phone number. Delete her phone number. Delete his, the allergy that is training you. Training you in the school. And also training your body. Check it. Make, amend your ways. Amend your ways. The adultery you committed. The fornication. The lies. The money they gave you to keep. And you ate up the money. Check it. Amend your ways. Look inwardly. Plead for the mercies of God upon your life. Call upon the Lord for mercy. Call the, the, the lying testimony, the false testimony. Check it, check it. Call upon the Lord, plead for His mercy.
plead for his mercy. Plead for his mercy. Oh, that today you will listen to his voice. Have they not your heart? Are you going about telling people about the movement at all? Check it. Check it. Check it. You can't be bold to preach. You can't be bold to tell the word about Jesus. Check it. You can't stand the presence of a woman. Praise for a man. Check it. Check it. Wherever you are. Wherever you are. You want to drop your boyfriend. You want to drop a girlfriend. They're lying. You want to go and confess their adultery. Their fornication. Their stealing. Their cheating. Whatever you've done. Whatever you've done. If you want the Holy Ghost, you must give your life to Jesus. You must repent. You must confess. You must make right your wrongs. Then wherever you are, today is the last day. Don't let this day pass you by. Don't let this day pass you by. Have you been touched? Is your life changed? Is your life changed? Is your life changed? Are you still the way you came? Today is the last day. Don't go the way you came. Wherever you are, rush to the altar. You want to give your life to Christ? To drop your boyfriend, drop your girlfriend, drop your boyfriend, drop masturbation, drop fornication. You want to drop lying, you want to drop cheating. Wherever you are, just stand at the altar, at the altar there, begin to confess it. Don't hide it. All the adultery, all the fornication, all the lies, all the lies, the handset you've taken, that money, somebody money in your disposal. Lying to your father, lying to your mother, lying to your brothers, lying to the government, all the cheating, all the fornication, all the adultery. Check yourself, check yourself. Are you a man second wife? A man second wife. You are the sugar daddy, you are the sugar mommy, you are still lusting, even in the camp here, even in the camp here, lusting after young girls, lusting after people's husband, lusting after men of God. Check yourself, check yourself. Today is the last day. Don't go the way you came. 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 Look inwardly. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Most High. 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 And plead for the mercy of God. Plead for the mercies of God. All the lies. Say to the matter now. Say to the matter now. All the unconfessings. All the unconfessings. All the unconfessings. Say to it now. 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 All the lies. All the giraffe method, all the bribery, you get bribed to get job, you get bribed to get job, you get bribed to cheat, all the cheating, all the lying, confess it now before the Lord. Confess it. Confess it. Plead for the mercies of God upon your life. Jesus name we pray now quickly say after me Heavenly Father I am a sinner I'm sorry for all the sins I have committed against you in my thoughts with my words and in my actions Lord forgive me blood of Jesus wash my sins away remove my name from the book of death and write my name in the book of life I believe from my heart I confess with my mouth Jesus Christ is Lord he died for my sins and came back to life on the third day Lord Jesus come into my heart be my Lord and my personal Savior thank you for saving me create in me a clean heart Renew within me a right spirit. Put your spirit in me and help me to walk in your world. I am born again in Jesus' name. Amen. Now you be on your feet. I want to pray. The two actually.
20 minutes was taken out of my time. So I'll use a few minutes. We shall use a few minutes now for prayers. If you return back, make every restitution. Even from here, you can begin to call on the phone and begin to make right your wrongs. Now, wherever you are, I want to pray now for Holy Ghost baptism, healing, miracles, and deliverance. Lift up your two hands wherever you are. The power of God will touch you, that young boy on the wheelchair. Wherever you are, rise up from that wheelchair. Drop that walking stick. Drop the walking stick. You are in the presence of Jesus. The Bible says no one living in Zion will say, I am sick. I take authority against sickness. I take authority against disease. I take authority against affliction. Let it disappear in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. HIV and AIDS. Go in the name of Jesus Christ. Cancer. Cancer of the lungs. Cancer of the breast. Any form of cancer. Ulcer. Asthma. Pneumonia. Hymia. Get out in the name of Jesus Christ. Diabetes. Your spawn counts. Typhoid fever. Malaria fever. Arthritis. I command disappear in the name of Jesus Christ. Miscarriage, barrenness. 23 people are here. I command that master, that abnormal master cycle. Yet it be corrected now in the name of Jesus Christ. All the eating the dream, swimming the dream, flying the dream, sex in the dream, all the bad dreams are cancelled in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the lame walk. Let the lame walk. Let the lame walk. Let the blind see. Let the blind see. I command the eyes of the blind. Be open in the name of Jesus Christ. I told, and we need all shots around. I decree by the power of God, any spirit husband, any spirit husband, spirit wife, spirit husband, spirit wife, I command by the, by the power of God, come out, come out, come out, in the name of Jesus Christ. with unclean spirit unclean spirit in the body unclean spirit unclean spirit unclean power unclean spirit I command fire 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 in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, it's happening. It's happening all over the places. All over. All over. All over. All over. All over. All over. All manner of sickness in this meeting. All manner of sickness. That kidney problem. That liver problem. That kidney problem. That liver disease, that liver disease, that kidney problem. Be 
Christ shall be in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Yet the miracle of God be established in your life. God's miracle. God's miracle. God's miracle. God's miracle. Let it come upon you now. Receive your miracle. Receive your miracles. Receive your miracle. Receive your miracle. Receive your miracles. Receive your healings. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, yes, I can sense healing all over. The young man they brought here with a spirit of insanity, spirit of madness, spirit of madness, disappeared in the name of Jesus Christ. Rise on your feet and begin to walk. If you are not walking before, rise up. Rise up. Jesus Christ has seen you. See that on God I have not. Such as I have, give I thee in the name of Jesus. Rise up and walk. 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 Jesus Christ has healed you. 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 Begin to walk. Walk to the altar. Begin to walk. Rise and walk. Drop the weak chair. Drop the weak chair. You are healed. You are delivered. You are set free. You are healed. You are delivered. You are set free. Check your body. Check your body. The Lord has healed you. 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 All manner of sickness is over. It's 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 over. In the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Check your body now. Check your body. This will I give their life to Christ. They should return back to their sins. Check your body. Want to pray finally now? Holy Ghost baptism upon you as a handover. Holy Ghost about baptism. They should go back to their seat. Those one that back to your seat. Lift up your hands. The power of God is coming upon you. Holy Ghost baptism. 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 The power of God is coming upon you. Until the Spirit be poured upon us from on high. Receive the baptism of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, you have received it. 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 Jesus is baptizing men there. Yes, take it. 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 Yes, I said 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 it. It's upon you. 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 Take it. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. I told us we need more ushers, more ushers. Look everywhere there. More ushers, more ushers. Take it on you. Please, your pastor said, all over, 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 all over. It's upon you. 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 Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In the name of Jesus Christ. 
Yes, all over, all over. Power of the Holy Power of the Holy Ghost. Power of the Holy Ghost. Power of the Holy Ghost. From the ground of your head to the soil of your feet. Please help me. Help them there. Come ahead. Soil of your feet. From your inside to your outside. Your inside. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Yes. Receive it. It's upon you. It's upon you. It's upon you. Receive it. It's all your life. It's all your life. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. It's all your life. All your life. All your life. Let's seven, 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 let's seven. We need more horses, please. More horses, please. In the name of Jesus, more horses, more horses. In the name of Jesus, power of the Holy Ghost, 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 power, power. Yes, sir, I said power. Yes, sir, I said power. Yes, sir, I said power. It's all over. Please go in and bring the man. All over. Power of the Holy Ghost. 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 Take it. Take it. Take it. It's for you. It's for you and for your children. Let's serve it. Let's serve it. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost, take over. Holy Ghost, take over. Holy Ghost, take over. Holy Ghost 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 power, power. Please head down. Power, 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 power of God. 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 It's all over. 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 Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In the name of Jesus. 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 Receive it. Receive it. Yes, thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. You will shout a greater amen and you will see wonders more in your life. Let the fire of God enter everywhere here in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, fire. Yes, fire. 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 Fire of God. 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 Please, not ushers, not ushers, not ushers. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. My horses, my horses. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus' name we pray. Whatever, he's the, he's the, he's the, whatever the devil has put in your body, in your body, in your body, any evil spirit in your body, I command, cast fire. 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 Fire.
on Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. It's all over. It's all over. It's all over. That kidney, the waist pain, the chest pain, the menstrual pain, the waist pain, the chest pain, the menstrual pain. I command to disappear by fire. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Shake your body. Yes, 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 yes. Maoshas, thank you, Father. Yes, it's done. It's done. Shake your body. That pain is no more there. That pain is no more there. That woman that may lie in that seas. Stand up. Jesus has seen you. Jesus has seen you. I decree. The Bible says by himself, he take away our sickness and diseases. I command now, yet every sickness here, whatever is the name, whatever is the name of the sickness, whatever is the name, whatever is the name, whatever is the name, I command, yet it get out now in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Begin to walk. You cannot walk. Begin to walk. Yes, the eyes of somebody is open. Praise the Lord. Look at the miracle there. Look at the miracle there. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. Look at miracle. Look at miracle. Begin to walk. Yes. 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 Begin to walk. Look at the miracles. Look at miracles. Yes. Rise up. Rise up. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. Jesus is here. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. All manner of sickness. All manner of disease. All manner of sickness. All manner of disease. Begin to walk. Check your body. Rise up and begin to walk. Rise up. He's not the only one. He's not the only one. Take the step of faith. By faith, stand up from that which year. Stand up from that which year. Stand up from that which year. Jesus has seen you. Jesus has seen you. Jesus has seen you. Check your bodies. You are here. 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 In the name of Jesus. You are here. In the name of Jesus. You are here. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, listen, 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 listen. Stroke is cancelled. Stroke is cancelled. Rise up and begin to walk. Rise up begin to walk. Begin to walk. Stroke is cancelled. Stroke is cancelled. Stroke is cancelled. Yes, cancelled. Begin to walk. Begin to walk. You cannot walk. Begin to walk. You cannot walk. Begin to walk. Jesus is here. This is holiness come ground. This is holiness come ground. Begin to walk. Yes, it's happening. It's happening all over. All over. All over. All over. All over. Thank you, Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name, we pray. Now listen. This is holiness, divine movement, come ground. More miracles all over. More miracles. Rise up. That person that can't see well. Just until you read. God has work on your eyes. Carry your Bible and read now. You can read without grass now. You can read without grass now. That waist pain, that kidney, that liver disease, that type of malaria, ulcer, asthma, cancer.
work is cancelled. 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 Resist strength to work. Resist strength to work. Resist strength to rise. Resist strength to rise. Resist. 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 It's happening your body. It's happening your life. It's happening your body. It's happening your life. Jesus name we pray. All that I heal, run out in here now. Begin to come out. All that I heal, check your body and run out. Check your body and run out. All that I heal, check your body. Where are they? You see your hand. You see your. You see your hand. Wonderful, wonderful. Look at hands. Come out. Look at hand. Those, I mean, those that heal. Wow. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, miracle all over. Why is she rejoicing? Please verify. Yes, you are healed. Let me see your hand. Let me with evidence. With evidence. With evidence. Rush here. Rush here. Rush here. Rush to the altar. Rush. Come. Come up. You are healed. Just stay here. You are healed. You are healed. You are healed. You are healed. The Lord has healed you. Wonderful. 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 Give the Lord a clap offering. Give the Lord a clap offering. You are here. You are here. Check it. Give the Lord a clap offering. Come out. Come up here. Come up here. Come up here. Give the Lord a clap offering. Give the Lord a clap offering. Give the Lord a clap offering. Yeah, then camp here. Just to camp here. Just here. Just here. Come up here. Yes. Yes. Wonderful. 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 Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. You are here. Just at the altar. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Give the Lord a care of me. 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 You are here. You are here. You are delivered. You are here. You are delivered. You are here. HIV negative. Also negative. Cancer negative. High BP negative. Low BP negative. Barrenness negative. Miscarriage negative. Miscarriage negative. Barrenness negative. Negative. Madness negative. Heart disease negative. Stomach ulcer negative. Stomach ulcer negative. 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 Very fine. A heal of what in the name of Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Give the Lord a care of it. 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 It is done. Your miracles are permanent. 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 Give your words. What is her mother before? She cannot walk before. She can't walk before. She's walking now. Hey, keep the Lord a cab of rain. And you are here. Praise the Lord. She is here of spinal problem. Spinal problem here. Here. You are delivered. Total is a tree. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. I don't know how many of them we can receive their testimony now. You are here, your voice. Another mic. Another mic. Give them a star mic. 
that we shall take on you three now and maybe in the we, if, if that we give chance we we'll hear more you are here you are delivered okay give mama first praise the lord praise the lord thank you jesus last confession by this i was not able to attend but i was a woman who have similar problem like my own for one and eight months now one year eight months now i lift a stone and my spinal cord become broken i've been moving from hospital to hospital the money they said should come for operation i couldn't have but i said let me come and this morning since i came i always sit at the back but today i said i want to sit at the front my husband told me yesterday that she he, that it will be out very early to sit at the front but i first him to be out i come and sit at the front i ask god question you have been doing wonderful i read the book of michael samuel michael sambo he said when he was sick they were to cut the leg and jesus came and bring a lap and fear to that leg and he was here when our father was saying something that he was inside the car and he got a cold accident but there was no wound on him and i said jesus i know you can do everything i now call jesus is it not you that do for bro my case sample come and did it for me did it for me i say god do it for me and he have did it for me <laughs> most of you have been noticing me if I walk a little, I will sit down. If I walk a little, I will sit. Throughout my stay here, I will sit down. If I lie down, I cannot move by myself. A lot of these women have been fetching water for me to bath since I came. Because I cannot rest off pearl with water. Father, I give you all the glory. Amen. Lord, I give you all the adoration. Please. That, oh. Okay, you are the husband. Yes, yes please. This, yes, yes, from the husband. Please, the rest of you, because of time, that, that we should stop for now, okay? Yet your miracles be permanent. Permanent. And you over there, you feel you are not healed before evening, it to be negative in your bodies. All kinds of sickness in Jesus' name. God bless you back to your seat. You testify in your chapters, in your location. And the rest, yes, 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 from the husband. God. Praise the Lord. Praise Love. the Lord. Brethren, today I am the most happy man. Because the last test done, she was to undergo surgery for 1.4 million. I look at myself. I said, where will I have this money? But I hung my trust on the Lord Jesus Christ. In the last convention in Maraba, she was not around. I was engaged in my pastoral work. But this time around, I said, no, I must make it. We were having a convention. I said, there is a convention above another convention that I must be here. I felt the power of God in the first city about the holiness revival. I know I met my pastor, Pastor Rickwell. I tell pastor, I have a problem, and the problem is that my wife is down. She cannot work for two years. She has not been to the office. But today, on a twinkling of an hour, speed of a second, the Lord Jesus Christ did it. I praise his name. I don't know what to do for him. I will sacrifice my life for Jesus. If you don't know Jesus, he is the ultimate. He is the power of God himself. If you trust in him, he will do for you. When the man of God was talking, I tell God, if I be a man of God, if you have called me, give me this miracle.
happen. I was not praying for myself. I was praying for her. My boy called Madam Simon Miss Passing. I look, I clean my eyes. She was the one. I ran after her. She was going around the camp. I had to leave her and I came back. I thank God. I thank God. I thank Amen. God. A clap of faith to the Lord. I thank God. Oh, thank God. Thank you, Lord, for the healing. Receive all the glory. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. We thank God this morning. The, the message you have just listened to is a production of Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide. Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide is a non-denominational ministry that is given to the propagation of Christ's righteousness and holiness in churches and nations of the world through crusades, revival meetings, production and spread of holiness literature and materials. For other spiritual materials, messages or inquiry, contact us on 0813-635-6813 and 0805-683-4323. You can also reach us through our email address, holinessrevivalmovement at gmail.com. God bless you. For God so loved the world, that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. Hallelujah. Jesus, I believe in you. my Lord and Savior, I believe in you, you are my living Savior, I believe in you, you are my
I believe you. 